how fast was the your followers and your, and, your, and your subscribers and stuff like that? How fast did that? After Dougie, it was just if I just refresh. 50, 50, 50, 50. Like, just refresh every five minutes, and I was refreshing every five minutes. And I don't do it so much anymore. But I was like, I couldn't believe it. I was like, nah, this gotta be, you know what I mean? Money conversations, we've been making business moves. Contemplating how to get it, need to get in tune. Different topics, we got options, you can pick and choose. If more income ain't the outcome, gotta switch the mood. We tryna help you to improve, thanks for asking. Road the riches, speak on broker days and past tense. Wealthy habits lately, I just wanna stack chips. Took a risk and we've been running up a bag since. G Vast Quest, quick to make a couple G's. Detox, spin knowledge, put you on your feet. Bug out, got the plate, make sure to pray before you eat. At the table, with the winners, come and take a seat. What up, what up, what up? For the next yeah. episode, thanks for asking. We got the dude that do damn near everything. So they call him OA and Detox. You do the interview, bro. Yup. Can I get some love from you? <laughs> Yo, what's good? All right. How you, Kellen? Can't complain. No doubt, no doubt. I can, but who gonna listen? That's a big thing. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, man, it's a pleasure having you here, man. Appreciate you having me. Um, <clears throat> my... you clear your shit up. Come on, Detox. What the fuck is that? <laughs> you know what I caught up in the what game, the man. That? No doubt. Eating that Chinese food chicken, man. That shit's fucking me up. You know what I'm saying? That's <laughs> not good for you, man. That shit is man, not good. That that <laughs> now, can you please proceed? Yeah, 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 yeah. That eats. We got my man OA here doing his thing, fresh out of Harlem. That's a fact. You know what I'm saying? How the f- we got Harlem in here. This is a second this is a second Harlem guest we had. That's a fact. Harlem yeah. yeah. right. always connected to Queens for some we reason. Got, uh, we had a chick named um Sharifa. She did a clothing line called Black and Ugly. Okay, okay. So was fire. she was dope. Was dope too. So so how'd you get into music? Uh well, I started music actually when I was like 14, 15. I was still in high school. Um, I think what Drake was out at the moment, and like that was like a, like an inspiration for me mm-hmm. heavy. Um, I think he had Best I Ever Had came out, and then oh, I, I just got that. into his catalog after that. So that's so crazy about Drake, where it's like, it's, he, when you hear him now, he doesn't even sound like what he nah, sounds like. Fact, you yeah. know what I'm saying? When you first hear him, like that's like a whole different Drake right there. Nah, you that's know what a saying? fact. So you know, to see his progression and stuff like that is dope. So. Drake was uh, the one who inspired you, and how, how? What did that inspiration look like back then? Uh, shit, I had at that time. At least for me, I I know like some some older heads might say like yeah, there was other like rappers singing and mm-hmm. rapping on tracks, but like for me, that was like the first real yeah artist that like I, I paid attention to yeah who Studied did both of those things. You feel, me? feel yeah. what I'm saying? So. Once I had, yo, once Best I Ever Had It, he was singing the hook, and then, like, the verse came in, I, I couldn't believe what I was hearing. I was like, nah, I got to do this. And, it was, it, it, and believe it or not, it was a mixture of Soldier Boy's inspiration. Not really, Soldier like... Soldier Boy, you mixed nah, in with not, Drake? Not, not, not really well, sound-wise. Drake hit me took out. some of Soldier Boy, hit me so out. don't do that. <laughs> hit me out. Hit me out. Shout out Soldier though, but, like, hit me out. Soldier had a black diamond Lamborghini chain, and it was, like, a remote mm. control car at the same time. I think I and, seen like, that one. I'm not too materialistic now, but at that time, like, I was like, nah, a black diamond Lamborghini chain? Yeah, yeah. It's crazy. Be. You feel me? I had never seen nothing like that, and I, I just knew, like, if I if I sound like Drake and get into the game, I'd mm. give me a black diamond Lamborghini chain. That was like, <laughs> you feel me? That was the set <laughs> goal. The black that's diamond goal. Like, yeah, that's all right. I'm like, if Soldier can do it, I could do it. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, yeah. So, but then, you know what I mean? I just kind of found a love for music and... It just went on from there. So what was it? It was making beats or was it rapping the singing? It was rapping first. Then it got into making beats just because I couldn't afford beats. And then it that became a passion. always start yeah, beat. Fact. <laughs> engineering, too, was just because I just had, had really? to learn it. Yeah, yeah fact. I, I, I did engineering, too. Like, I went to school for that and all that. Like, oh, shit. Yeah. Not I yet. mean, I was a Cubase. I was a Cubase head, so. Okay, I started off Adobe Audition. Then I went. See, but now that, now more talk, logic. Man. That's like my. We thing. don't know that talk. We ain't supposed to. She <laughs> <laughs> ain't doing nah, me. She ain't doing me. Fuck with you. <laughs> nah, logic is. <laughs> I can. Most producers do logic. Nah, yeah, logic. Logic, my baby, right now. But I couldn't afford a Mac, so. I feel that. I, that. <laughs> I, I was in that boat too. Yeah, that, that, that shit is that shit expensive to the motherfucker, B. So, 
What was your first moment that you felt like you was a part of the, uh, the industry? Uh, shit, I still don't really feel like I'm part of the industry. Mm. You're a part of the industry. You're a part of that you shit. Are, uh, You're a one man yo, band. You got, you part got of my industry. man, you know what I'm saying? Prank Jr. Prank. <laughs> <laughs> keep trying to. Yo, bro, I love this shit, bro. <laughs> He gonna kill me. Nah, yeah. He gonna kill me, B. You know what it is, yo. We don't want to kill you, bro. Just say P2. It's simple, bro. P2. Thank you, man. Don't say it was a boy every time, bro. That's what I'm saying. Like, I don't, I'm not even saying a whole motherfucking name like he a ball player or some shit like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, the only time you say somebody's whole name is if they playing ball. Like, say P2 to keep it simple, but yeah. he's very much a part of the culture because he has, like, this. Uh, this is my bro for over t- ten years. That's so a fact. Say, we go back. He got a. He had the biggest platform in New York for mm. drill music, mm. and drill music is the biggest platform in New York right now. So hell honestly, yeah. I can say he had the biggest platform. Shout out to Gabe on the radar and all that, mm. but my boy got the biggest platform right now. Nah, nah. Shout out to Gabe, man. Gabe, Gabe's helped me out a lot, man. Don't, don't put me in trouble with Gabe. <laughs> <laughs> Gabe, Gabe, Gabe. Gabe's helped me make some money, man. <laughs> I fucks with Gabe heavy. So how did you? So how do you go from Drake to? Drill, shy K, and, and and I mean it's a it's a huge gap in between that. Uh, uh, so take me through that gap. So like <laughs> double pause. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm fucking dead. But uh, so boom. On the flip side, like on on my film side, you mm-hmm. know what I mean. Like I, I got like a a a, a kind of like a, a Hannah Montana kind of like you know what I mean double side. Uh, on the flip side, on my film side. I run a platform named Hazard Lights where like various artists come perform in a car. Um, it caught traction around like last, I started it last March, but it caught traction like last, last July when I got an artist named Dougie B on it. Shout out to Dougie B. Nah, yeah, facts, facts. <laughs> Shout out to Dougie B. You know what I mean? I know Dougie. I like Dougie. Uh, but yeah, since then I've been kind of like just heavy in the drill scene. Mm-hmm. Uh, personally, it's not my favorite kind of music. You know what I mean? Just on, on a personal note, I, I like a few. I like a few artists though. Uh, but yeah, like that platform mainly became. Like, I don't want to. I don't want to box it in and say it's only for drill artists. But drill is what like took it's it to the love. next level. Yeah, you know yeah, what I'm trying yeah. to say? It's because I'm in New York. It's mm. the most popular. Um, How'd you get Ducky B on there? Oh shit! Through, through a mutual friend. Shout out! Shout out! Uh, shout out! My good sister Jaja, man. She, she looked out. I had asked her one day. She's a rapper. Yeah, she a rapper. Oh, she was on the radar Jaja. too. Yeah, yeah facts, I know facts. her too. She was she was a, she was a connection behind that, and I and I had people that was following each other. Right, I was I hit her up like I used to work with her when I was working at Starbucks. I was like, That's yo, crazy. I was like, yo, gang, you know Dougie? You, you trying to tell him, you know what I mean? I hop on the platform. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't really expected to like, you know yeah, what I mean, pan out, out, but yeah. yo, it panned out and shit, it worked out. And <laughs> You know what I mean, right now we on uh 26k subscribers on YouTube. Wow, um, that's 15k phenomenal. on Hell Instagram. Yeah, give them a clap round for that. Man. Hell Hell yeah. And yeah, I'm just trying to just make trying to like balance that while still working on music. Uh, my life is kind of everywhere, but in a good way. You know what I'm trying to say? I can imagine. Yeah. So, but so before you you know before you started your platform. You was acting too? Nah, nah. He he just said I was an actor and a model. Just to throw <laughs> that in there. I'm not an actor and a model. He's too big in that shit up like that. I'm, I, <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm not against it, but right now I'm not an actor and a model. You wouldn't do that? You wouldn't do Nah, it? I definitely would. I definitely would. Like later on down the line, like I'd want to take classes for that. Like me mm. personally, I got to like feel more comfortable in front of that, like acting in front of a camera. Mm, mm. So, you know, you started doing music. When um did you have any rough patches where you was like yeah why am I doing this and, and shit like that like, oh yeah did... a few especially mm-hmm. like especially in the beginning so like where I started in 2010 like early 2010 mm-hmm. so at that time uh, I'm actually gonna tell you a story only like my close friends know okay like so, exclusive okay. Well, baby. right right <laughs> and this is a believe it or not story you know what I mean mm-hmm. so. Yeah, y'all know Joey Badass, right? Y'all yeah, right? I know Joey. So back in the day, before this is before Joey Badass was named Joey Badass. He used to be named J O V. Just mm-hmm. a regular kid from Brooklyn. I had found him on YouTube, and we would just do tracks together. You yeah. feel me? Like this, this un like I made him private just because I wasn't trying to clout chase. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. But like me and him used to do a bunch of tracks together and shit. So like at the time, I think fast forward a little bit. I'm 17. 
17 or 18. I'm 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 in haze with him right mm-hmm. with him, him at the moment. And I just wake up. This is when MTV was still playing like music videos. I literally just wake up getting ready for school. I see this nigga on MTV. With the uh hard the hard lock? Nah, nah. It was the uh survival tactics. Mm. And I'm like, I can't believe it. Cause I, I ain't spoke to them in, in a few months at that yeah. moment. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm looking like, is that really him? Like, just imagine, like, yeah. you know what I mean? I hadn't had anyone around me ever make it yet. It was just, yeah. I'm thinking of quitting because I, I don't think this is realistic. You <laughs> feel <laughs> what I'm right, saying? Right. Like, yeah, yeah, want to be a yeah. rapper? Come yeah. on, bro. So I'm like, I just see him on TV. I'm like, nah, wait. So so I, at that time, he still had his regular Facebook. Mm-hmm. Like, he's not super famous yet at this moment. You mm-hmm. feel what I'm saying? So he still had his regular Facebook. So I go on my phone right quick, go to his page. Match it to the TV because the video is still playing. <laughs> I'm like, like this shit gotta be real. I'm like, am I dreaming? Am I? You feel what I'm saying? Am I mm. like? It's really him. So I'm like, nah, that's that's insane. Fast forward again, he got a song with Mac Miller, and as you see, he's super. Yeah, he's on. Yeah, he's on fire now. Yeah, he's, you know what I mean. Like, and and to me that 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 was like the defining moment when I realized, all right, this shit is real, bro. Yeah, you know what I'm right, saying? This shit right. is like... And you never spoke to him after that? Yo, we never... Because, like, all right, this is the thing. We was only, like, internet friends. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It wasn't yeah. like like me and him. Like, I, I know him. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah. I never met him a day in my life. We were just talking on the internet. We were just sending each other tracks back and forth. Mm. Uh, and at the time, like, like I said, I was, like, 14, 15... If you from Harlem, you just wasn't traveling to Brooklyn. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. I, <laughs> like, I know. Especially at that time, bro. Uh, yeah, like crazy. And so you got tracks with him? Nah, yeah, I got tracks. It's still, it's. St- I still keep them like my YouTube private. You know, I mean, just to, it's to reminisce. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, you should have put my own shit. It was out for a while, but some DJ made a like a co- in like 2012, 2013, made like a compilation tape, mm. and then I would see comments. I think Joey had shared the compilation tape and they had like one of our old tracks on it. Mm. And I would see comments, yo, Joey sent me here. And I'm like, nah, that's not the that's not the image I'm going for here. Like, mm. you know what I mean? I, I ain't wanna like, you know what I mean? Like it probably makes anybody else would have done it, but in my head, I'm like, I don't wanna be just the random nigga who had tracks with Joey. And now he's, you feel what I'm saying? Like nah, you overthought that situation. I did a little bit, I but agree. it was like I'm- I, I take I, see they I don't want to take handouts. Bug and G, they want to work, do hard work. Give me the handout. <laughs> Fuck that. Nah, I, I wouldn't even say <laughs> it's it's hard handout. Enough, <laughs> it was just like nah. It ain't really, and on top of that, he was in another lane musically. Yeah, and, and so was I too. And it was like just just forget career wise, just creative wise. Like yeah. I ain't really want that song out. Mm-hmm. And I'm sure he probably wouldn't have want that song out mm-hmm. neither. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Because yeah, it just wasn't. He it was wasn't making sense. He was seventeen when he first came. Nah, yeah, I was yeah, like, facts. Dude, seventeen. Mm-hmm. Facts. He was like, I remember nice. it. Like, I mean, like his Facebook. Is, but... His Facebook went from like regular pictures yeah. to like. Now to look back, it was just regular professional camera yeah, pictures. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. at the time, the seventeen-year-old professional picture. He's like, oh no, that's that Sony A7 yeah. over there. You know what I'm saying? Before I'm all like, the little bullshit phones and shit. I'm like, yo, <laughs> what's going on? You feel me? I didn't, I didn't know he was getting signed at that moment like he wasn't vocal about it he wasn't mm-hmm. like bragging about mm-hmm. it it was just mm-hmm. you could just see the change via facebook yeah. via the internet yeah. i think he had like a, a video on world star that was going viral at the time too him like just rapping mm. uh with a few friends and shit but not yeah but him for sure like not to go too deep into joy but like he was one of the first and main people that like made me realize yo you could really you know what i'm you saying do this shit. you could really do this shit. it's <laughs> really real like you feel what i'm saying yeah and, and yeah, since then I just been. Like, I've had a little doubts here and there, but I honestly just I it's, it's a few other people I look up to now and just mm-hmm. like who who's been around me and I've seen like get success, but I still drag it back to that corner. Like even when I'm watching what's the the, the Wu Tang shit, oh, and he had, he had yeah. a few scenes in that. Like that's even to this age, this is still a mind fuck to me. Yeah. I'm like yo. That's re- like you know what I mean. Like, I, I I did music with. Nah, yeah, that's crazy. Yeah. You feel what I'm that's saying? That's real. That is real. Oh. Uh, how did you get into doing this 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 uh I don't know if you want to call it a podcast, a show. Uh what do you with with um with the drill scene? How did you get involved in that? So uh there's a platform actually that's out right now called From the Block, mm-hmm. where they like hang a mic. Uh right, yeah, I know that. I know that. There's a bunch of them now, yeah, but like yeah. it's the, the he, main like main the one. Yeah, yeah, the main one. So uh, a friend of mine had hooked me up with uh 
with the director mm-hmm. and when he came to New York in like 2021 and you know what I mean he 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 blessed it let me go on the platform and I was just oh, looking Oh you spit on it yeah, too. Yeah, facts. I was just looking like oh. I was I was waiting for him. I was waiting for him. I was waiting for him. He made sure he paused it. Paul. Right. <laughs> but uh but yeah, he had blessed it, man. And you feel me? I was just I think at the time he was charging fifteen hundred. I, I I he didn't charge me, but he was charging fifteen hundred. Mm. So I started counting the people that was coming because like here's the way like the, the way it was is I had to be there first to get my free slot. Yeah. And you know what I mean? I kinda just chilled there after like mm-hmm. it's a see, you feel me? All my friends was there and shit. And I'm just watching people and I'm thinking, okay, fifteen hundred. I've seen like fourteen people come in. Fourteen times fifteen hundred. In one day? Yo, in just one day. And he That's was doing real. the second day. So I'm like, Whoa. Oh, Whoa. I'm not saying he charged all the people. And like I, I was fake, yeah. for most of them. I was yeah, fake yeah. pocket watching, but not like in a I didn't want him to have it sort of way. Yeah. It was like, all right. Like, yo, they getting money. Yeah, you getting money here, right bro. now. You feel <laughs> me? Like this is a come up. So yeah. I'm like, all right. And it, it was outside of just you not know, the money side, it was just creative. So yeah. I, I had never seen that at the moment. So I'm like, nah, that's that's pretty crazy. So I, I, I kind of uh, want to do it, but I ain't want to like copy off his whole yeah. his whole idea. So I'm like, all right, let me do it in a car. Mm-hmm. You feel what I'm saying? It was like, I'm like, all right, bet. I thought of the car because like, I don't really like cold weather. So I got to. I have to make this work. You know what I mean? I'm weird not thing to be... with New Yorkers. We love New York, but hate the fucking nah, cold. Nah, it's <laughs> cold. Not, that's it, part it, of New York. I know, though. That's, like, that's, that's so New York. Yeah. Like, I feel like I feel like the cold not meant for black folks. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> like, like we, we we naturally come from warm environments. That's you feel fact. what I'm saying? Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. So like, yeah, I don't really fuck with the cold and just to beat the weather. You feel what I'm saying? It's like even even for even for the from the block performances, like if it's pouring down rain outside. That could fuck up the shoot. You might yeah. have to push that back. Yeah. You feel what I'm saying? So I'm like, all right, with a car, I can just. It don't matter. It don't matter as long as it's not a, like a fucking blizzard or yeah, a tornado yeah. outside. Shit, you can do that you know motherfucker mean? in that bitch too. Yeah, <laughs> you know what I mean? It's just. It's easy. Dope concept, though. Should be shaky a little, but you know, on the tornado, but you know. And then, yeah, like I just. They come in the car, perform. Right now, I charge 500 an episode. Um. On average, I, I book around seven people a month. There'd be more asking, but I try to limit it. You know what mm-hmm. I'm trying to say? Uh, that's so a real concept, though. Word. Appreciate Word, it. That's appreciate very, it. Uh, and I try to limit it and just... and try. I try to get at least seven small artists just to gotta give them a little boost. Mm-hmm. At first, it was like 24 small artists, and I was like, okay, boom, I gotta cut it down just because YouTube algorithm wasn't fucking with it. So I was like, the viewers want to see people with a name. Mm-hmm. So to fit the smaller people in, I have to take in less. You feel mm-hmm. what I'm saying? It's like, and, and yeah, I just. So so talk to me about the algorithm and uh, like, how did you figure out? Or when did you realize that this shit is really working? Was it really when? Um... Uh, when I started getting paid off of YouTube, for sure. Mm. But uh, the algorithm is, I, I got it down just by trial and error. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm trying to say? It's like, there was one month where I had like, like I said, it's when I realized I had too many small artists. It's okay. Let me let me let me break it break down. Break it to the beginning too, man. Like, cause I, you know, if somebody else, if you're giving somebody else inspiration to start, like, it's always the begin. The hardest part is the beginning. Cause once the shit money rolling in, it's just fine tuning it. I, I would say for me in the beginning, it wasn't too hard because I had the camera equipment already. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm trying to say? I had all that. I had yeah. Every piece of camera equipment, other than like the the the, the mounts. Okay. So I I just bought that and mm-hmm. boom, it was it was all set. Uh, in the first few months, I was just renting cars. Like I would do it every weekend. I was working like three jobs at the time and shit. Damn. Um, and barely making like a thousand a week. Shit, shit was trash. So it was like it was a lot going on. It was, this yeah. was just last year too. So I'm like, I was like, damn, I'm 28, 27 at the time. I'm like, damn, I'm 27. Working at Starbucks, driving for a bakery, mm. and then like I was like doing some little part time Amazon shit. So I'm like, nah, 
This shit trash. I gotta. You feel me? I had already thought of the idea, but I gotta now put the shit. Three jobs, bro. Mexican. This man was getting canceled. I ain't even gonna respond to that. (laughs) But nah, yeah, I was just working and working, and then like I was using that to fund the rentals. Cause first I was just doing them all for free. Yeah, I'm trying to say, cause like I had to just yeah, you trying to get content. Yeah, so uh, I would just hit up artists that I knew, cause I was shooting music videos prior. Uh, I would just hit up artists I knew, friends that I knew, you know what I mean? Got a few people, and by like the third round of shoots, I started charging people a hundred. Mm. And my goal was if I could make a thousand a week, doing because I was doing it every week so far. That was like the third week, yeah, doing it every weekend. And I was like, if I can make a thousand each weekend, I can quit my jobs because yeah. I'm not making a thousand at my <laughs> jobs. <laughs> the fuck am I doing? You feel what I'm saying? Uh, so yeah, it got to the point where I was, I think like fourth or fifth week started hitting that a thousand mark. I'm like, okay, I'm still risking on quitting my job. So like I was quitting, like I got laid off from Amazon. Then I quit. No, no, I got fired from the bakery after. And then I, I held Damn, on to Starbucks. Man. You got a lot. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, held, I held on to Starbucks for a few months in just in case. Job, <laughs> <work> out, right? <laughs> nah, yeah, I held on to Starbucks for a few months and I was like. Yeah, it's time for this to go. Because I was only working like one day there. Like, mm-hmm. I had set my schedule mm-hmm. to work one day. And a lot of the times I would call out on that one day. So you just never see oh, me yeah, at yeah, Starbucks. Yeah. But they wouldn't fire me just because they, they kind of like knew like mm-hmm. what I was doing. Like the manager was mad cool. Mm-hmm. Shout, shout out to my manager, Sean, man. He, he didn't <laughs> fire me. He Sean, didn't fire Sean. me. And I was late a lot of times, man. <laughs> I was late. I barely did any work. I did the bare minimum. God damn. Man. <laughs> I was over it. Like, you could see it in my eyes. I was over being here. You feel what I'm saying? And But yeah, he didn't fire me, man. He just kind of understood. Like, he knew what I was trying to do. Mm-hmm. Uh, and yeah, like, I would, like I said, I would just rent cars until it was it was July. I started seeing, like, wow, I got a lot of artists lined up. It was like the beginning of July. And I was like, damn, it's either I rent for the month, which mm-hmm. was like $1,300, or just buy a car. So I'm mm-hmm. like, all right. I know if I rent for the month, yeah, it's thirteen hundred, but I won't have to handle any maintenance, this, et cetera. Car, my credit was good, so I was like, I could just get a car mm-hmm. and barely put anything down because I just knew my credit was yeah. pretty good. So I went with the car option. It was really like a sporadic thought. You mean you brought the car? Yeah, like brought okay, the car, okay. yeah, facts. And I was like, all right, boom. I just typed in a random dealership. I ain't no shit about buying a car, respectfully. I was just like, yo. I knew it had to have like decent mileage. Yeah. That's all I knew. I didn't know shit. I got I kinda got lucky they didn't just scam me. Yeah. You feel me? I just got a you, you know go what to mean? Major World? Nah, I went to some shit called <laughs> Victory <laughs> Mitsubishi. <laughs> oh, oh, that was, that was, that was <laughs> joke went over my head. <laughs> <laughs> but nah, yeah, like uh I had yeah, I just went to some random dealership, brought my man's with me, and I left that shit with a car. I was mm. like, fuck it. You know what I mean? And then I just started doing the shits out of that. And then I started traveling. That's when, like, it started getting kind of, like, like, that's when I realized it was getting bigger. Like, first I hit UK. I went pretty decent. Oh, no. Traveling, nah. traveling. I'm thinking Next you talking about going to, like, nah, Germany. Traveling, and traveling. Like, yeah. I'm fucking set up on the UK. World. Yeah. World. And I hit Jamaica. Uh, and right after that, DR. And I just started, like, Linking artists out there. Um, How fast was the your followers and your and your, and your subscribers and stuff like that? How fast did that? After Dougie, it was just if I just refresh, <laughs> 50, 50, 50, 50, like Damn. just refresh every five minutes, and I was refreshing every five minutes. <laughs> now, I don't do it so much anymore. <laughs> but I was like, I couldn't believe it. I was like, Nah, this gotta be. You know what I mean? Welcome to my life. <laughs> 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 he got the negative he got the negative clout but uh yeah like i just kept refreshing 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 and then like youtube let me become a partner so i was like all right bet it's time to like mm. really eat off this and yeah. shit and shit what does a partner mean like you get paid off youtube you get to oh, monetize okay, okay. your videos oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah yeah and yeah like since then, it's just been like a. For me, it feels like a dream, bro. Like I just feel like it's yeah, just, I'm gonna wake up. No more no more. Oh, bro, I, I I just wake up, pretty much do. I mean, I mean, I, I have shit to do. You got work, but it ain't you like I mean? you working like, at yeah. Starbucks coming late. Thinking, yeah. 
That's yeah, a fact. Yeah, that's a yeah. fact. Making it all for music and yeah, shit like, like that. I be I be more tired than when I was working, but it's like it, it's it's more fulfilling. Yeah. You know what I mean? So yeah. I like Yeah, it's something yeah. you want to do. So it's different. It's, a bigger it's not even right. a job. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Wow. I never had a car in my life. <laughs> I don't work mad jobs and never had a car, bro. I mean, big part big of that's due to poor financial planning, but the biggest part was the poor finances. Yeah, like yeah, if you get yeah. paid seven hundred yeah. after taxes a week. Oh. Yeah, if you getting, uh, you can't really, yo, you can't financially save. plan properly if you're making, if you're below yeah. the, the poverty line and paying mad bills. Like if I was a teenager, that would have been like probably yeah. Yeah. better than shit. But you know what I mean? As a grown man, twenty seven, going on twenty eight at the time, seven hundred was not worth. Yeah. I was like, nah. Especially after just coming off of unemployment, niggas was paying me a rack a week. Oh, oh man. man, I miss unemployment. <laughs> I wish I was doing this while he unemployment. Said he missed unemployment. Oh man. <laughs> <laughs> if I was doing this while doing unemployment, first of all, all the drill rappers wouldn't have been locked up and indicted. The ones that I'm to, I would have been able to get in contact with them. Oh, man. You know what I'm saying? They would have been fresh on the scene, too, so yeah. they wouldn't have been too Hollywood. Yeah. Did bad by not thinking of it then, God, but you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah look, it all happens. Yeah. Cool. That's what got me the camera happen. equipment, though. You know what I mean? Mm. Getting that thousand a week, I was like, I, I ain't never seen money like that at the time. Yeah. I was like, Say no more, but I'm like I'm 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 smart. Like don't get me wrong, some of it went to a lot of it went to weed, but like a lot of it, 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 a lot of it, a lot of it went to like camera equipment, uh, trips. That that was a mix, a hit, a a hit and miss of vacation slash work. Like I would shoot videos on the trips, but I would just look for any reason to go to L.A. Any any reason. It was one time me and all my friends went to L.A. three three times in a month. I'm like, yo, why do we even do that? We went to San Francisco for one day. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, yo, who the fuck do we think? Oh, my God. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It was like, my, nah, yeah, a lot of it went to trips. and But I knew I had to get the camera equipment because originally the camera equipment was for me to, like, shoot videos and shit. You know what I'm saying? And mm. pff, it's like, bro, it, it, mm. life took a, a major 360 last year, and I just... I don't know, man. It just feels like a dream, bro. Feels like I'm gonna wake up anytime. So, what was your uh, what's who 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 would you want to have as the biggest artist on? Who's the next? Who who was the biggest artist and who you want next? So, the biggest artist for me personally. This is not really talking numbers, but just for me because it, it was my favorite rapper when I was a kid, Cassidy. I had him on the oh wow, I had him on the platform. Uh, That's dope. Nah, yeah, he he, That's dope. he was humble. He was nice to meet, bro. Like that, that shit was like a mind fuck. You feel what I'm saying? It was like, if you had told me like a year from now I'd have Cassidy on the on your platform, show. I was like, yeah. Like there was a moment like I'm not really fanned out. You feel what I'm saying? But like I, I know how to like recognize a surreal moment. Yeah, you feel yeah, me? I'm, yeah, I'm fully yeah. aware. Mm-hmm. I remember when he just walked into the car. I'm like, nah, this is really about to happen. Like wow. I told myself that. I'm like, nah, Cash really about to get in the car and on my platform. So it's like. That's dope. Nah, yeah, Cass was definitely dope. one of the biggest. Uh, another one that that I really fucked with. Uh, you heard of Lola Brooke? Yes. Yeah, yeah I had her. I talk about her continuously nah, yeah, yeah. on here. I had her right before the blow up. Right before the blow up. That's the best yeah, time. Yeah, yeah. Right. Before, I mean, like next week she got like co-signed with like Cardi B or something. Oh, she was out yeah, of here. So done. You done. She was out of here. The next, nah, you know who you need next? You need that girl, uh, Scarlett. Yo, I've, I've tried, bro. She's real hot right now. Yeah, I, mean, I, I, I won't go too deep in it. You know what I'm saying? She's but hot it, right now. We've tried a thousand times. It just... It just ain't working. Didn't, it didn't work out. It didn't work out. You feel what I'm saying? We gotta get Shout out to Scarlip, though. It just didn't work out. But uh, it, there's a few other people I, I do want. I, I want Joey, definitely. Ooh, and I, you I, heard I, that, Joey? I, I hope he don't see this podcast until after he gets on because like yeah. my goal is because like I know he don't remember how it look it's yeah. been you know what I mean however long more than 10 years bro mm. like I, last time he probably would have seen my face on the internet at that you feel what I'm saying yeah, yeah. I'd have been 17 you and I'm surprised, you know what I mean surprised. true but like my thing is outside of him just performing I was gonna play one of our old songs mm. while recording it. You feel what I'm saying? I hope he never sees it. And if you see this, act surprised because we're still <laughs> doing that. We're still doing that skit. You feel yeah. what I'm saying? So I was like, you know what I mean? Just to get a reaction, see how the reaction is. Like, how the fuck yeah, did yeah. I get this song? Yeah. yeah. Then you're gonna like, you know what I mean? So I feel like that'll do views. Plus, it would just be like a 
like a like one of them like moments, mm-hmm. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You feel me? Like like uh ASAP Rocky and um uh oh, what's that little uh, the black ASAP Rocky and the one who got locked up. Naka? No, the one um Come on, I knew they knew each he other. He was like the uh he was in he was a he was a gangster. He got caught up with the he was signed to Hove in them, and he was signed to be uh, Memphis Casanova. Blue. Casanova. Mm, okay, okay, okay. Casanova. And they was locked up together. Nah, and yeah, he didn't yeah, remember yeah. him. Yeah, that, that type of moment. <laughs> remember remember that? Yeah, 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 I yeah, seen yeah, that story. Yeah. They had a fight in the shower. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it was crazy. Yeah, it was crazy. <laughs> Yo, yeah, he was slipping over the team and the shit. <laughs> oh my God, yeah, I don't remember that. That sound crazy. I don't remember that part, but yeah. Nah, yeah, that that was definitely in the story. But, but nah, yeah, it just be a moment. So like, yeah. I would I would love to have him on the show and shit. Uh, and Drake, Drake, that would be the. Oh, that'd be. I know yeah. once and I Soulja get Drake, Boy too. Oh, yeah, once I get Soulja Boy. Not, <laughs> no, I don't know, know, know that, bro. Never know that, man. I, I'm up. trying for soldier as we speak, man. Soldier soldier on there. Speak. Make sure he bring that 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 chain if he still nah, got it. I hope he still has it, man. <laughs> I'm like, yo, let me just have it. <laughs> let me just have it. Let me just have it, man. Yeah. No cap, but like, uh, but yeah, I'm trying for soldier right now. It's a hit or miss, but I didn't expect Cassidy, so you know what I mean? Soldier come on there. Never so know. Come back to the block sometimes. Never know. He going on tour. I'm trying to catch him while he on tour yeah. in New York. Yeah. Oh, that yeah, is yeah. Right. He yeah, come on. Yeah, he come yeah. to New York in May. I, I was watching the dates. I know mm. one of his like friends. So I yeah. was like, yo, I was gonna be like, yo, trying to put it put on. Put in the word. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean, like, hopefully that works out. And yeah. G, you got anything? Oh, nah, man, but I think you're a dope artist, man, and I think everything you're doing is, is, is like, you know, special, yeah, man. Right. I appreciate it. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You need to keep doing it. You rap, too? You rap, too? Yeah, yeah, that's sing. what you say. Wait, hold on. You, you rap, rap or you rap? Nah, I can rap. Well, let me hear you rap. Nah, I, I ain't just... I, I rather <laughs> you play, don't I rap, rather, dude. I'd rather rap. play a song, man. I'd rather play a song. I'm not like a... I'm not like a Cassidy or 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 Eminem. I'm That's not about I to spit on the record. Right like you do rap, that, rap. you got to set us a song. Yeah, yeah. Put it over I, I song. consider myself more of a musician, but like I got I could, you. I got you. I can really rap though. Yeah, I got you. Like, I got you. No cocky shit. Really, really rap though. Yeah, you know man. P two, you got anything? I know this nigga. I don't got nothing. Keep doing your thing though, bro. Appreciate it. But me seeing his work ethic from like since we was teenagers, bro, like. We would be doing some other shit. He'd be at gym. We'd be playing basketball. He'd be writing, or he'll be listening to music, or he'll be like he over oh, this nigga, this nigga after school, dude. like yo, let's chill out. I'm going home, bro. Yeah, he was one of the guys. That's an artist. That's what that's an artist. I can honestly say when he went his Grammy, like I need to be there because I can vouch for him. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like yeah. I've really seen it from the yeah, that's from dope. The, that's dope. We appreciate yeah. you coming through, though, bro. Appreciate y'all having me, man. Yo, oh. It's a pleasure. Nice meeting you, man. Uh, plug has the lights too. Oh, plug has the lights. Everybody know, but you still plug has the lights. Plug with you. Mean? Like shout it out. Like I mean, yeah, yeah. put your show you know on, man. Put, I wish I had the hoodie with me. I, 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 wore, I wore it in my last interview, and I'm like, nah, I can't. You feel me? Can't wear it again. But uh, shout out to Has the Lights, man. Go check that out. Shout out always the page. Um, shit, let's go up. Shout out to thanks for asking. That's for sure. That's Shout right. out to Thanks for asking. That's the podcast. Oh, my fault. I, yo, I thought he said. He don't know where you at. Nah, nah, nah. nah, 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 nah you know what I thought he said? I thought he said, Shout out to Dykes for asking. I was like, <laughs> oh, that's good. I ain't really know how to respond to that. <laughs> nah, shout out to Nah, yeah, yeah. Shout out Thanks for asking for sure, man. I appreciate y'all for having me. Yo, last thing, last thing before you go. I know we got to wrap up. We need your top five artists, man. Oh man, top five artists. Oh, I bet Drake, <laughs> Drake, Hov, Nas. Uh, yo, yo, actually, put Nas at number two is because Illmatic that that came out on the day I was born. You know what I mean? April nineteenth, nineteen ninety four. Man, that's a couple days. So if, yeah, you, really? if you ever want to, if you ever want to know my age, I'm the same age as Illmatic, literally. That's you know? wow. That's, that's Ill, now that's wow. Illmatic uh, man, for real. <laughs> uh, Hov number three. Cast number four, five. Damn, damn, five. Wayne not in your top five. No, that's his nah. top five, B. That's his top Wayne, five. Wayne's in my top ten. <laughs> Wayne in my oh, top five, bro. Top five. Word, I can't even tell you who's five. the fifth one right now, but. <laughs> I fuck with Jada. He in my top ten, but I, I can't. Front put Soldier Boy in number five. Oh, <laughs> I don't want to say Soldier Boy. Soldier Boy. 
<laughs> Yo, let, let's let's put Kanye as number two, Nas number three, Hole four. You said Cassidy. Cassidy number five. All Perfect. Right, that's yeah, cool. Yeah, that's yeah. cool. Facts. Can't be mad at you. All, All right. right. That's thanks for asking us a wrap. Peace. Peace. Peace.